Let me call. Let me calm down because God wouldn't like the way I talk right now. The Lord said, "Let there be rod knocking." <laughs> So anyways, you guys have been following me for a while. You guys have known that um, I never beat on my trucks. I like to baby them. Never done a burnout before. I just drive it to the church on Sundays. And uh, yeah, my truck's broken. So am I. They should be pissing me the fuck off, bro. Every single fucking time I want to sell the truck. But it's crazy. We're here at a fucking church. Well, actually, you know what? Let me call, let me calm down because God wouldn't like the way I talk right now. The Lord said, let there be rod knocking. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um, to be honest, is the truck gonna sell? I don't know, the guy's coming tomorrow. I'm kind of contemplating right now, calling him and telling him. At the end of the day, I was gonna make a video titled, my SEMA truck costs this much money. But it looks like we're gonna be adding a whole lot more money to that fucking title, bro. Broken engine, we just put the transmission back in. Everything was fine and dandy. It's not like I've ever just fucking gone and done rolling burnouts from the street. Like, that's not me. But it's broken now, so I guess if this video doesn't get released, then I'm just talking to a camera for no reason. If this video does get released, then it turns out that uh, my SEMA truck is going to cost me a whole lot more money. And now I guess it's the time where we're going to decide what are we going to do? Do we want to go ahead and do a direct replacement? Just go ahead and get it back up and running again. Should we build it? Should we get rid of the lift kit? There's so many things that we could do with this truck. If, are we gonna sell it? I don't know. Maybe I can just tell the guy. Maybe I'll just knock. Maybe I'll just knock fucking fifty grand off of his price and be like, if you want the truck, take it with a blown engine. But we'll figure it out. He's been he's been taking every weekend off for the past month, and I feel so bad. Yo, buddy. Hey, what's up? I have I have awful news for you. What happened? I'm just gonna let you. I'm just gonna let you hear it yourself. Hear that? The, the motor doing that yeah, I just I turned the key and it just started knocking. Something's not right. Huh? 
Yeah, well, I think God doesn't want me to sell this truck, but it is, you know, you want it, you want it, I'm more than happy to sell it to you. If you want to come tomorrow again, like I said, come tomorrow and then we'll do Fucking night, bro. Oh. I can't even know. I don't even know where to begin with you guys. Oh. So we're back at the shop. No truck. But uh, you already know I always have a solution for everything. I ain't worried about it. Let's go ahead. Load up the old rig. We're going to go over there. Load up the old truck. And we'll be good, bro. I ain't tripping on it. We'll make another trip back, swing around, grab the backhoe, and we'll be straight. At the end of the day, brother, it ain't none to it, but to do it ain't that right. Hopefully, I remember how to do this right. My truck used to be G56. but to do it brothers like i told y'all fucking go ahead drop this bad boy off you guys we'll get it done hopefully good oh my goodness i can't believe it maybe oh yeah you guys can see the storms coming in right outside of church what a fucking mess this is It's like Halloween, we just don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> Very last one, Very and last we're one right fucking there, golden. Number six. Number six, and we're ready to send them off for testing. Well, CJ, introduce yourself to the people that might not know you. Oh, my name is CJ. And then CJ gets the luxury treatment around here. Topside creepers, but we'll make it work. Got the pad for my fucking beautiful ribs. So. You guys might know CJ from his platinum or seeing him on IG or TikTok. I just got, it's a, just a white platinum, you know, everyone's fucking got one, so it's nothing it, crazy. It's just a run of the mill platinum. It's yeah. nothing special. It's not like, it's not like it's got those big ass rims on it or anything, but hey, CJ, Mitch, we did it. We did do it indeed. Yeah, but hey, me stay. better than ah! a- <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you got a little bit longer on the watch? Mommy said 20 more minutes. 20 more minutes, you can hang out with the boys uh, in the shop. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you. I yeah, think you're going with, too. We're good. Oh, yeah. damn, man. You got a little. <laughs> you got a little sauce. Yeah, Am I Simba? Yeah, yeah. No, you're it's, Simba. It's a side Simba. You're cleaning with the rag. It's still on there, bro. It's a little side Simba. Yeah, with a yeah. dirty ass rag. You're a good job, boy. Dude, what the fuck? That's one of the cleanest ones. I got oh, that out of the new pile. All right, look. I got the clean spot right here. <laughs>
you're doomed. That's literally what Dan's Diesel basically told me when they said that my injectors were just fine. So yes, we are going to get started on this. And like I said, I'm no mechanic. Don't take advice from me. Just take it with a grain of salt. This is a pretty big undertaking. I'm not gonna lie when I tell you I, I'm, not, I'm not a fucking mechanic because I'm not a fucking mechanic. I don't really know what I'm doing half the time. Oh, that, I, that, you know, that was acceptable. I'm surprised this engine made it this long. Y'all know that I drive my trucks like a grandpa on Sunday, but y'all, it, it lasts me six years. What can I say? Let's get it popping, everybody. Let's just keep it moving. Hey, bro. Ain't no damn way, bro. That's fucking crazy, bro. That's nuts. Let me see if I got a car for this. <laughs> Wait, you got tricks like that, bro? Damn, that's nuts. Okay. I think that's good. If you guys don't like this, we will never shoot a video like this again. I hope you guys like it. As always, thank you for tuning in. I appreciate y'all. So let's go get to work. All right, so let's go ahead and start getting the, we gotta go start getting this fucking, um, uh, uh, no, let's say I gotta fucking start draining the coolant right now. I got the oil <laughs> out of it. Oh shit, does this bucket leak? Oh shit, this bucket leaks. I celebrated my victory too early. That's what I did, to be honest. That's what I was, that's my problem right there. Is celebrating my victories way too early. Ugh. A little bit of degreaser and she'll be fucking dandy. Oh no. Oh no, has it gotten that bad that we're pouring into a drum now? Oh lord. <gasps> Found one. How that'll do. I don't know. All right. Good little social media break. Ugh. So much shaft play. Yellow boy, you're the team to your loose. Yo, what's up, everyone? Um, I know I'm not Sebastian. Uh, my name's Jacob. I'm the new guy. Um, over here filming for Sebastian because Sebastian's out in the field right now working, um, doing his, you know, boss moves. But today we are getting everything taken apart uh, we we got a majority of it yesterday and we're trying to figure out what the whole problem or the cause is with the engine um, it's making a knocking noise so we're trying to figure out what it is oh, yeah, I don't know if Sebastian touched up on this but uh, in the video when we took his turbo off we found some pieces of metal right here um, we think it might be the valve seat uh, but look at this amazing, beautiful paint. This thing is just so beautiful. My bad. I'm filming on the GoPro, so. Um, but, dude, it's just so beautiful. 
So I've had the opportunity to come and work for Sebastian and help him out with YouTube and everything. So uh, hopefully it works out. All right, guys. Well, we're getting ready to pull the head off. Um, I don't know if you guys can see my hands, but hopefully I got this at the right angle. But this is how we're doing it. So we got a chain and a skid steer, and yeah, that's gonna be uh, just lovely. Okay, bro. Safety meeting. Huh? Safety, Safety meeting. Mmm. Bring no, 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 no. Leveled out, leveled out. I got a little quick update, right quick. Take the head off. Stinky. And, uh, smell like diesel, oil, and uh, coolant. So it's amazing. So I hope you guys like me. You know, me and come to the channel. Um, I'm very excited. So I'm very thankful that Sebastian gave me the opportunity. So yeah, no, I will update you guys when we pull, get ready to pull it out. So. All right, everybody, welcome back to day number three. Uh, part number three, I don't know. Uh, taking this truck apart. Uh, um, basically, to recap what's going on is I got the fan off. Uh, I got to take the balancing plate off, water pump, CP3, ECM, the oil, uh, whatever this is. I forget what it's called. Uh, and then the brackets. And then we'll go from there. And then we still got the flex plate back here. And then this little housing that's got to come out. So, um, yeah, so I got my hands full for a little bit. But, get some Dr. Pepper. Uh, but, got the fan off. It's right here. I'm about to figure out where I'm. Uh, what's up guys um so a little update um we so i got the motor you know out i took everything off uh um water pump the oil filter thing um the fan everything uh only thing i saw to take out just the ecm the computer and the cp3 I have all this little shaft I have to take out in the first thing in the morning, but I'm tired. Uh, I'm also very dirty, but you know, it's just stuff you gotta deal with when you're working on motors. Um, got the flex plate and uh, the little bracket thing. Um, I gotta pull these sleeves tomorrow too, and there's another sleeve on top. Basically, uh, a little pair of channel locks uh, right there. Um, little pair of channel locks and just slightly, you know, rotate it and pull it out. You don't want to yank it out because you can damage it. But I gotta take this, uh, I, I don't know what really this is right here. I guess that bolts in the, the flex plate. Uh, take this bracket off. Um, take the oil pan off. Get everything ready. Uh, then tomorrow we're gonna take the pistons out. Check everything. Um, and so but uh yeah all the pistons hit uh they have scarring and everything um you can tell they hit uh the valves so that doesn't look too good um so we got to figure out what the main problem was i think also you know uh i think also tomorrow you know we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do with it uh, I've got to go to the machine shop, so it's better we figure out what the problem is, so then we know what we're going to be looking at for the machine shop. Um, but yeah, that's just an update. I mean, there's no, as like I showed you guys earlier, there's no uh, engine in here, so it's all right there. But yeah, everything's out. I got everything clean underneath the truck, uh, so there's no more mess. But yeah, no, we got parts laying around, so we got parts all right here. Um, you know, the brace, radiator, intercooler, the fans right there. 
Um, and then we got, you know, the lower plates, you know, uh, oil pump, uh, the balancing plates, the turbos, everything, injectors, rods, uh, you know, valve covers, um, you know, the head, the shit stuff for the head, um, just a little stuff, so, but yeah, no, we're gonna catch up on everything tomorrow, so, just wanna give you guys an update, so, but yeah, appreciate it, appreciate you guys watching, and help, you know, supporting, if you guys haven't already, click the subscribe button, you know, join the fam, you know, we're trying to get to 100,000 subscribers, so, but yeah, also too, uh, if you're going to Michigan and Auto Show, uh, we'll see you there. Um, just hit me and Sebastian. I'll be behind the camera filming everything. So, but yeah, hopefully it's a good show. Sadly, the Mega Slab's not going to make it out, but you know, it's got to go under construction. But the Mega Slab V2 version two is coming out here pretty soon. So, y'all stay tuned for that. So, but yeah, we're gonna go home. Um, we're tired. We've been working all day. And uh, had a good day, getting good progress with the engine. So good thing is we got the engine out. No one got hurt. So, but yeah, no, keep you updated, and we'll pick back up this tomorrow. So I'll see you guys later. Baby, I'm East Lake Laurent. Whoa, bus I ride a DM slider, family and friends provider. Well, yes, I'm him that ass too slim. I 